Hello everyone, welcome back. Hold on one minute. Whew, I had to look around to make sure there was no one in my personal space so that I could take my mask down. Uh, some things have changed here at Bessie Creek since you were last here. Uh, one of these things being uh, one of the big changes. Um, but I wanted to take this time to introduce myself to the new boys and girls coming to Bessie Creek and also welcome back the returning Gators. Um, some of you will be online re uh, learning remotely and some of you will be in class with me. Now the big difference this year is that our activities have to be what's called socially distanced. So we have to make sure that we're six feet away from the other boys and girls while we're at PE. Now if you're at home you really don't have to worry about that because you're ultimately socially distanced. So that's a good thing. Um, but that's just one more step at school that we're going to have to be aware of. Um, now we also have to wear masks, um, but the good thing is, PE, you're coming outside and that's one of the safest places that you can be because you're in open air. As long as you're socially distanced away from people, um, we'll be able to take our masks down. But that's going to be one of my rules. We're going to have to come out to PE with our masks on um, and then we'll have to look around and then when I feel it's safe for everyone to take their masks off, um, I'll let you take your masks down and get some fresh air. Um, and if you don't feel comfortable taking your mask off, the boys and girls won't have to. Um, and I'm kind of going over these things so that the people who are remote and they see us do certain things at PE, they'll know why we're doing that. Um, now for you remote boys and girls, sometimes the Wi-Fi, which is how I get my signal to do videos, sometimes it goes out. So on my Google Classroom, I will have links of activities that the same activities that we're going to be doing in class. So if you ever lose me on Zoom, you're just going to go to my Google Classroom and you'll be able to do the same exact activities. Um, a lot of the activities at PE are going to be individual activities. Um, they're going to be video based, um, exercising, stretching. Um, we'll have some skills also. And if there's a lesson coming up that you, you boys and girls at home may need a certain, like a tennis ball or a basketball, I'll let you know that um, and we can modify it for you boys and girls so you're going to have the same experiences. And we're going to have a great time. Um, I'm working, learning my, how to move around the gym, how to move around the area with a camera. Um, so you're going to have to bear with me the first couple weeks, but I think we're going to have a great time and I'll be checking on you guys often. I'll try to stay on camera as most I can, but if something happens on one side of the area and I have to move for a minute, I'll right, be right back and I'll explain what I was doing. Um, but I'm going to pause right here. I'm going to step outside and I'm going to take you boys and girls on a tour because some of you haven't been here before and some of you haven't been here since March. So I'm just going to kind of take you guys on a tour with the computer outside and show you around a little bit. So hang on one second and I'll be right back. Okay, I said I'd be right back but I never really went anywhere because I just hit pause on the computer. So I'm going to go outside. Notice I had to put my mask on because I'm going into an area where there may be some other people. So I'm going to go outside with my computer and I'm going to try not to make you seasick by walking around with the computer. Okay, so I stepped outside. Whoa, spinning around. So I'm outside. I'm going to look around. I don't see anybody around me, so I can go ahead and pull my mask down. Again, you have to wait for the boys and girls that are at school. They're going to have to wait for instructions from the teacher um, if they can take their masks off or not. But in PE, I'm going to make sure that you guys can take them off um, as most as possible as long as we can stay safe. So I'm going to take my mask down because I don't see anyone around. Whoo, that's hot. Um, another important thing for you at home and for the boys and girls here, it's important to drink a lot of water. We want to stay hydrated because um, that helps us sweat and helps us get all the germs out of our body. So I'm going to work with the light here and there we go. All right, so for those of you that um, were here before, it kind of looks very similar. Uh, we have the portables in the background. Let me get out of the picture. Um, and then this is the basketball court where we're going to do most of our PE from. If you can see that, I'm kind of on a, I'm on my Chromebook, so my video isn't the best, but I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to walk us over here. Let me walk straight so I don't trip and fall. There we go. So I'm going to walk over here, and if you see behind me, let me see if I can move the camera. You can see the rock wall that we have. I don't think we're going to be able to use that right away, just because I have to find a way to be able to clean it after everyone uses it. Because again, we want to keep our germs to ourselves. Um, now, this is the field. If you can see out there, we got a basketball court out there. Um, now, I'm gonna to try to keep most of my lessons under the covered area because when I get further on the field, I lose my signal. So most of my lessons are gonna be in here. And again, they're gonna be less skill-based lessons, uh, throwing and catching to yourself. Um, I am allowed, I'm gonna have some of the boys and girls here throw with a partner. Uh, but if you're at home, you can throw with mom and dad, maybe a big sister, brother, little sister, brother. And you can incorporate the whole family with my lessons. We're gonna have a great time. Um, I'll put up some dance lessons for us, and I'm going to try to set the camera up 
um, so that you can see me all the time, but also that you can see some of the boys and girls that are in your class. Because we want to make sure that um, they know who else is in their class. Um, but we're going to have a great time. I look forward to seeing all of you soon. If you need to get in touch with me, you can email me, and I'll put my email onto my class webpage. Um, you can call the school to get in touch with me, um, whatever you need. I'm here to help you. Um, I'm here to have a good time with all of you, and we're going to get through this together, and we're going to have the best time we can. Um, so I look forward to seeing you soon, and stay safe, and I can't wait to see you guys back here at Bessie Creek. See ya.